Garvin Liua. I've been at AJ Matters for six years now, five as a home health aide and one as the staff coordinator and scheduler for the home care program. So what I do as the staff coordinator and scheduler is that I get with the aides and our seniors and I kind of match them together um, based on what I think, you know, what that client needs and what the uh, aide is able to provide. And um, just pretty much uh, ensure that our seniors are getting the services that they need from home care to personal care. So that's kind of what my role is. And I also do the schedules and schedule where the aides are supposed to be. Um, well, I kind of fell into it by accident. Um, I was trying to look for a career that would give me some kind of satisfaction, but at the same time, um, provide for my family. And I was going to school, so I decided to do the home health uh, CNA program, and that's kind of how I got here to Aging Matters. What I love about Aging Matters is the dedication to our seniors, um, being a home health aide for the five years that I worked. Um, I got the privilege to meet so many amazing people, to hear so many amazing stories, and just to hear them tell me how much I made a difference to their day and to their lives, and not just from the clients, from family and neighbors and friends, so I just love it. I love what I do here, and I love the purpose and the mission behind Aging Matters. Honored to receive uh, the Above and Beyond Award from the Aging Matters. I'm amazed. There's so many wonderful people that work for this organization that work hard, and you can just tell they are 100% committed to this, what we do here. And so, for me to get picked, I felt so special. I, I just love it. I look at it at least 50 times a day. I just love it. <laughs> My favorite word is optimism. I approach my daily life with, you know, the thought that anything can happen if I just keep at it and I work hard and persevere, I'll, I'll get there. So I, I try to keep my optimism in everything that I do. Support is definitely a big part of friendship to me. I just think it's good to have a friend that you can lean on when you're having a bad day. You know, they lend their ear and they don't judge you, they just hear you out. So support is very important. My sisters, I have three sisters, one older and two younger, and they are amazing. They support me in everything that I do. They root me on. I, I just love them so much. I have, I would think teaching. I love um, just learning new things and being able to teach people what I know. So teaching would definitely be my second choice. Drawing, um, believe it or not, I can play a musical instrument. I play the trombone. I played since I was in uh, middle school. So I would love to be able to draw though. It's an amazing skill. I just always envy people who can draw. My dad, he played the trumpet and my brother played the saxophone, so we were a brass family. He was like, oh, you should try the trombone. I was like, yeah, I will. He said, it looked like me. So I said, it called me. I think it was meant for me. Because it was long in my arms. I was, in my family, I have the long arms and everything, so. my motto is definitely be the change that you want to see in the world and so um, all the good things that I want to see in other people I try to embody in myself. Uh, well to date um, this week I officially finished my bachelor's in organizational management with a healthcare specialization so that's my greatest achievement today. Uh, Eastern Florida State College Cocoa Campus. My, my children, I have four boys, one girl, 
and I would do anything for them. I just, they're, they're everything to me. Um, I just think an Aging Matters is a great organization and what they do and the mission is just so important and I think that I'm just lucky, lucky to be a part of it. I'm, I'm very grateful.